How are you doing, Taurus? Taurus, you get the oh yeah, Taurus. This is your reading for the week of uh, 19th to the 25th. Starting off the reading off the bat, you get the Queen of Swords. You might have been a bit defensive towards a connection or situation you might have been in with the Four of Cups. I feel like you're getting bored. You're getting bored of uh, sticking in your ways. You're getting bored in um, uh, sinking in this heartbreak. You're getting a bit bored of your old ways, your old uh, ideas. It's just, it's just get in touch with yourself. You might be feeling like there's a situation which left you feeling a bit, a sense of loss, a, lot, a sense of pain, dealing with a Capricorn or just uh, something a bit more toxic, feeling like you have to be protective of your energy, uh, feeling like you have to focus on your work, your finances. Uh, with the Queen of... Uh, Excuse me, with the devil card, I feel like you might have been a bit too toxic to yourself or to the connection. And uh, if you're being toxic to yourself, it might be uh, balance yourself out, balance out uh, your needs and your, what you really desire. Uh, balance out your work life, uh, your heart, your mind, and soul. Balance out your needs. Um. <clears throat> I feel like you might have been bored in a connection because you you, you had to walk away. Oh, you feel like uh, you had to let something go because you haven't done Because maybe you invested in, in it so, for so long. Let's see. Let's all get into it. situation Taurus you get the two of pentacles you might have been needing to balance out your finances or balance out your options balance out your uh, situation uh, with the two of pentacles I feel like there's a great need for you to balance out uh, what you have around or what you got going on with the knight of wands and the queen of cups you might be approaching somebody uh, who really desires your love who really wants your love and whoever you might be coming to meet Oh, with a death card in reverse, you might be meeting somebody from the past or coming in contact with somebody from the past as you're seeking out this love. It, it's going to result into a, a partnership in terms of uh, home settlement, in terms of let's lay down a foundation for this connection. Let's be more happy. Let's enjoy this moment. Let's enjoy this uh, uh, connection. Let's enjoy what we have around us. With the death card in reverse, feel like something you might have thought it's dead done over with. However, it's not truly done. You're being called to go back to it. If this is a connection you were in, uh, I feel like uh, I feel like maybe in the past they did not go fully right. Um, uh, it could have been in the past the, with the King of Wands. You were ready with the. You had this charm, you had this glow, and you had your finances ready with the Ten of Pentacles. Or oh, currently you're feeling financially settled, you're feeling uh, a bit more ambitious towards uh, what you want. However, something doesn't feel like it's going right with the Seven of Swords. It feels like something didn't go to plan, something really uh, took a turn. And you're being uh, asked to kind of leave the situation. And as you leave the situation... As you feel more abandoned and more settled, as you feel like you have this charm around you, you uh, you feel like you want to take action. You might be wanting to take action towards uh, somebody or you who's being a bit defensive. You're being asked to take action towards the situation that you might have let go. Uh, or if this is coming to love or other connection... Uh, Three of Cups. You might be dealing... You might be in a third party or you're dealing with... Um, somebody who puts you in third parties or just you are enjoying this success and victory with your family and you get bored of that uh, this could be with the three of cups it's also a family union it's like we're enjoying this moment with the family we're being happy and all but we you know we're realizing it's not you know we, it's not enough it's not what we desire with the 444 um i feel like it's playfulness it's, it's just a moment of being playful enjoying what you have around you 
However, you're realizing that, you know, it's not, maybe it's not what you need. You want your own happiness. You want your own person. You want your own connection to be truly um, enjoyable. With the five of uh, cups, there is this energy of feeling spilled cups. I feel like this situation is not going to go to plan. Um, for your reading, you get the four of cups, the, excuse me, the eight of cups. Uh, you feel, you waiting when a situation to come to life or you not fully accepting the situation uh or you ignoring a connection or you not wanting to um face the connection again it could have been something you let go in the past or something you're deciding to let go and at the same time with the eight of cups it's kind of like you're walking away you're walking away from a situation you're greatly invested in to seek something that's more fulfilling um i feel like you might be deciding to put your walk on pause to put your ideas on pause to this to focus on love uh if this is work related it could be like you invested a lot of time in your business and you were like this is not hitting the spot for me so i'm going to seek out something more uh, a bit more uh self-indulgent with the four of cups it's like i'm bored being in the same situation i'm bored with this connection or just if a connection is approaching you or you've been having a love offer it's kind of um it's coming to me when I don't need it. However, it's also causing you to realize uh, maybe I need to focus on something that's a bit more settling. If you might have been stuck in a connection which feels really uh, happy and exciting, you might have been... Uh, if Yeah, if this is a connection that's really happy and exciting, kind of like I've been in it for a good time, you know, we all celebrating, but it's the same shit over and over again, and you're deciding to walk away. Uh, you're walking away to truly... Um, something you you thought it was dead done over with i feel like you're going back to a situation with the death card something is not fully ended um if this is a connection you are in and just deciding to walk away uh in the future it might be with the death card in reverse I feel like something you thought it was dead done over with however it's not you know the time for it to end is not there yet you know you still have an opportunity with the ace of wands i feel like this opportunity is truly being uh, delayed is being held back uh there's something that gives you a spark of uh, light a spark of energy just adds flame to you something that makes you more exciting or excited about your future um and with the page of pentacles also in reverse you're being encouraged not to take action right now put it on pause you have the idea you have the blueprints it's just like you can make it come to life however pause you might be needing to focus on love with these cups being upright focus on love focus on situations that you might have walked away and uh, if you walked away with the situation living it in a bit of um chaotic mindset mind state Give it a chance. With the King of Wands, uh, I feel like it might be a good chance to reconnect with the people around you, stick in your beliefs, stick in your ideas. Um, but reconnect, uh, accept others for who they are, and uh, they will accept you for who that you are. There's no need to change anybody with the King of Wands. However, it's like everybody is enjoying this moment around them, being happy and excited. You might have been feeling like you got left out in a situation with the Ten of Pentacles. Uh, you might have been feeling like the situation didn't go to plan and it put you in this energy of a uh, king of so king of souls trying to cut off the connection however as you cut it off as you cut it off you realize you have this anxiety and you're feeling left out in the cold um it might be a need for you to um just revisit it i guess um uh, give it a chance give it a another look uh don't get in your head too much because as you get in your head you're putting yourself in a spot in terms of i can't rest instead of you having these moments where you can't rest it might be a good time to really uh uh give things another look settle it down um give just you might be feeling left out in the cold but yeah maybe think about things try trying to come to a close you know trying to Trying to invest in this situation, not not rushing, but just try to invest it a step at a time. Yeah.